think of the futuristic cities of the world, uh, centers of innovation and technology, I think, you know, we've been coming to Dubai here for 20 years and we've seen what this place is capable of. This is a very modern place, you know, it's come out of the sand in 50 years and it's incredible to think what's been achieved here. What a city it's grown into, a very international cosmopolitan city. Something like the Expo that's been taken all over the world shows a lot about what Dubai is all about. Expo 2020 obviously been pushed to the end of this year. They're ahead of the game when it comes to innovation and everything. Chandra Shekhar Kuntia Dubai ru pochi. Kali to Dubai re gote exhibition ro kumbha mela arambha hochi. Taku World Expo 2020 Dubai kochanti. Kali to mane October 1 tarikh ru seta October 1 2021 ru. मार्च एक तीस दो हजार बाईस पर जनता चली हुआ छह मास चली हुआ इटा मने वर्ल्ड्स रो सब तो बिगेस्ट शो इटा मने उटे एक्सिबिशन रो ओलिम्पिक्स कोई परिवे इतने पूरा पृथ्वी रो सौ एक बार नंबर टा कंट्रीज पार्टिसिपेट कर चुनती सित्रे अपनों का रो ट्रेड आर्ट कल्चर टूरिज्म मने सिविलाइजेशन फूड इतरे इंडिया भी बहुत बड़ा उड़े पेबिलियन तैयारी कर ची 400-500 कोटी टन का खर्च करी कि इंडिया गवर्नमेंट उड़े बहुत बड़ा मने सिर्फ मने डेढ़ एकड़ जमी नहीं कि उड़े पेबिलियन तैयारी कर ची जोड़ा कि उड़े परमानेंट स्ट्रक्चर इंडिया हाउस बोली कि तकु रखी वाले से गवर्नमेंट प्लान कर ची ये जो पैनल्स को नहीं कि तैयारी कर कराई चीज़ जोड़ा कि मने संध्या मने आट्टा पौरे चिड़ा उटे मूव करी बो जोटे कि हमारा पूरा होल इंडिया रो टूरिज्म सेशनेशन को देखे बो हमारा कल्चर को देखे बो हमारा ट्रेडिशंस को शोकेस करी बो टूरिज्म टूरिस्ट को एट्रैक करी नमस्कार जय जगन्नाथ मूड डॉक्टर चंद्रशेखर great minds are going to cook up for the next 50 years. I'm having the opportunity to be in Dubai a couple times now and to see the spectacular show that they can put on. I really can't wait to, to see what's going to happen. Certainly looking forward to all the amazing exhibits and events that they're going to have going on around the Expo. Expo 2020 is going to be showcasing innovative technologies, uh, new ways of thinking. We are going to see the Expo 2020 Expo 2020. It's a big deal, so uh, the whole world will come here. This will be the focus of the world. And obviously with the Expo, who knows what, what's capable with the technologies, the way they're going, what, what those great minds are going to cook up for the next 50 years. I'm having the opportunity to be in Dubai a couple times now and to see the spectacular show that they can put on. I really can't wait to, to see what's going to happen. Certainly looking forward to all the amazing exhibits and events that they're going to have going on around the Expo. Opening ceremony. Expo 2020 is going to be showcasing. In that showcasing. truly extraordinary uh, Wassel Dome. But throughout the next six months of creativity and celebration here. As you can see to the left and to the right of that, just past the Uella musicians and dancers. Dancers of and performers of all ages. And then just past them, some of the traditional handicrafts, the heritage and the culture of the UAE, which again will be celebrated over the course of Expo 2020 Dubai. The traditional welcome, not just to the proud Emiratis, who are making their way down the Al Wassel Avenue. Well, they make their way.
way out to the Al Wessel Plaza and then into the Al Wessel Dome. But to all those nationalities who are getting their first taste of true Emirati and Bedouin hospitality. And that is one of the reasons why this event has been so much anticipated. Emiratis, Arabs across the region renowned for their hospitality. And this is a truly global opportunity for them to welcome the world. That will happen in the opening ceremony, which takes place in the Al Wassel Dome there in the heart of your picture. The picture there as it pans out over some of the extraordinary facilities built in and around the expo site. Through the extraordinary infrastructure of roads, a dedicated metro line, a dedicated metro station, brings you to the very doorstep of the expo site hotels, accommodation, and all the infrastructure that goes around maintaining a site of this size. And size is something that uh, will wow every single visitor to this site. It is larger than the Principality of Monaco. It is the equivalent of 600 plus football fields. It is a truly extraordinary feat of engineering and creativity and it's so good to see it come to fruition here and to see guests of all nationalities making their way down the Al Wassel Avenue towards the dome where they'll prepare themselves for a spectacular ceremony that in itself sort of embodies the spirit and the theme of why we come together not just for tonight the official opening ceremony but throughout the next six months the welcome to the world will of course be performed by artists musicians actors actresses global superstars are plenty who've all come together to celebrate the start of the event to kick it off in some style to act as a catalyst of hope as well over a thousand performers will be taking to the dome there to offer a breathtaking experience crews from all over the world have been working together to bring together this the story of hope the United Nations this week talking about this catalyst of hope, how an event like this can influence and give hope to so many around the world that we can live in the time of COVID, we can hold events on this scale. And that in many ways will be reflected in the themes of the opening ceremony a little later on. We can expect a spectacle of stunning visuals, music and performances. Thank you.